So here we have the two versions of the MyPro protector case for the BBC Microbit. We have the normal version, which you can see here, and we also have a wall mountable version, which you can see here. So let's take a look at each in more detail. So here we have the standard version of the MyPro case. The case is made of layered acrylic and gives good protection to the BBC Microbit. The front allows for clear viewing of the LEDs and we have nice big indications for the A and B button. We've also left the pins exposed, so if you do have an edge connector breakout board, you can still use this with the case. Along the top, you still have access to the USB port, the reset switch, and the JST connector for the two times A battery holder. And it also allows this battery holder to be mounted onto the back of the case. So it's securely in position, gives one nice, easy to handle unit. And the case itself also now stands up if you put it on a desktop. We also have a wall mountable version of the case. This case is much thinner, so it only needs three layers of acrylic. And on the edges, we now have mounting points. So these can be used to mount the case securely to a wall or to a desktop, should you wish. Now, as the battery pack isn't connected on the back, it will mount tight against a wall. And in this case, we've powered it from a USB connection. So this is ideal if you want to have a permanently powered solution. So if you had um, a micro bit on a wall scrolling a message and you wanted to do that all day long, you could power it using a USB cable connected to a, a power supply. Both versions of the case are supplied like this, where you get a, a number of layers of acrylic and some screws and nuts. The layers are layered around the micro bit and then the nuts and screws are used to secure the acrylic into place. To explain how to do this, we've created a very neat guide with some easy to follow instructions showing you the order in which the layers are placed and how to put them together. For more accessories and project ideas for the BBC Microbit, please visit kittronic.co.uk.